choose, I think they still take this. I, I still think this is a, a 2 0. -oh. Repeat back to base, so you won't be able to do that again. That's yeah, it's back to base and uh, X back to the mid lane, so it, it really has not been going well. Nothing to say again, and we have been seeing this become a pretty, con pretty much a constant where mid is continuing is that, to is just died. get destroyed here, and he goes down to dust. And Dust is one of those guys who we have seen for <laughs> the longest time uh, in, in the Division 2 scene. He had come from a long time with IG Vitality, gets the chance with Magma, and as they get now TZY killing off Y top, they'll go for Ame and oh, on in. him as well. Shield crash, right click. I don't know how much you want to stand there. Earn onto Ame, and he is going to get dove under the tier one tower and die. So LGD all of a sudden losing heroes, but the. Yeah, I've been very impressed by their performances. There's the X, the deal breath, looking for the blast off the charge. So now they've got the silence. That means there's no blink away. And with that, they get the kill. It's Jinku gets Queen Queen Thunder, Ice Path, not gonna do anything and now tzy coming back the other way he's gonna look for the swashbuckle by all of a sudden and the strike God. comes out and that hits onto tzy under the tower keeping y alive earn ticks out ame though he's getting attacked by mercy charge in dust oh that's the sonic wave off just before the blast off hits but with the mines jinkyu able to get the kill he's stunned up for a while Thanks to this ogre smash from the ogre bruiser. Oh, there's the mine with the charge, but the snowball avoiding both and getting the kill. Oh, another mine though. Another mine. Bong. This time getting the kill. <laughs> oh man, what a hero. And now he has the proximity nice. mines as well. Taking a look at the replay here. And uh, clamping on. I'm coming. Sorry, nothing to say. In some trouble. X back though. I never fooled. End up dead. Tango's farming faster than Spirit Breaker, but now they want to make a move and it's the unspoke. Yeah, but they've got Ice Pep. Ooh, misses though. And now they're looking for the Terrorize. It lands onto the Jakiro. Proximity mine down. The damage being done. They've got the Ghost Ship, but the Snowball saved. Curse Crown stuns up too. The Snowball hits on it. Nothing to say. They've got the charge coming out. They get the kill on the Kaz. Looking over it. Dust Blast off is there, but into the Stone Gaze. Jinkyu ends up dead. Sonic Wave comes out with Rolling Thunder trying to hit the Spirit Breaker and eventually does. Dust and Mercy surviving on a low amount of health with the help over from BE. That being said, Mercy has more farm than him at the moment. And it looks like they skank. Potentially be devastating. And Q has shown up. They do have Bobby over to the side, but they look over at Faith Beyond to get the kill on the one to start. They've got the curse crown onto the Jakiro. A sticky mine and a, a proximity mine were placed down. Not doing enough damage. Ame, though, with the right clicks out onto the Dark Willow. Terrorize lands onto nothing to say. They've got the X on a dust pulling him back into a mine, but. And they're trying to find other ways to get this done. Mines down and damage being dealt here to the Dark Willow. Nothing to say will eventually get credit for that kill. They'll try to take this tier one tower. They'll look for more. Blast off use, TZY, not in range. And they're still looking. Dust is backstabbing. Sticky bomb, it explodes, and all of a sudden Merch is coming in with dust. Nothing to say. He is looking like he's gonna drop again. Charge is gonna be away from the fight. They're gonna keep up with Y. They already have the techies TP out, so that's gonna be not one but two there for Magma, and they lead 14-10 by 5k. The next, and the problem is also the Quap is having a fantastic game. Yeah, no surprise again. Now we see Dust having a great time. Bottom lane, once again, they will try to kill off this Pango, and they do so. Damage to find his team. Definitely seems likely. Ame, he is gonna get caught. Blink, scream, and the silence, but they've got the Yules. The charge comes out, it lands on both. They have the strike to follow it up, because they have the damage to get the kill here on a Dust, the Sonic Wave, the Ice Path, oh, avoided! With the snowball. They blast off, they catch Mercy, but they only catch Mercy. Queen of Pain was able to elude yeah. them. And then all this time, they've just been fighting without the Medusa. 
Man, I'm looking for him now. I don't think that's actually kill him. Uh, we'll try it. Macro fire, ice pad, touring, all coming in. Sticky bomb thrown out. They're getting rid of a lot of the mana, but it's not looking like it's gonna matter. They get the kill on to Faith Beyond. They find themselves nothing to say. We'll pop the BKB, the sticky bomb. They'll avoid it. And they'll get up onto the high ground. They'll look for the techies. They've got the Yules, the Shadow Strike. It's on to the techies. They should be able to get the kill. They'll throw a sticky bomb in desperation, but it won't do anything. And now, they'll also finish off nothing to say. They find techies again. And they're gonna try and get some help here from Hame. Finally does some damage to get the kill on a Kaz. They did get the disarm on two, but they have the follow-ups coming through. Sonic Wave is out, Hame, that's not really worth it. This is not the best move. It felt like he was maybe forced to get involved with the way the game's going for him. They have the X, they'll look for the torrent, but again, there's the snowball, the blink forward from dust, the charges coming out from feet beyond. It'll come from the side. They've got the ice pad. They should be able to maybe get this kill on dust, but they have themselves the Fuels up into the air, avoiding the pullback on the axe and the turret. So they get the kill on a face beyond. It looks like nothing to say. Now without mana or now without a team is in trouble. I'm always for it. If the team shows up, that performs well. Why again? Caught again. And he throws out some damage, but it's not really going to do anything. Yeah, I'm loving how Magma's playing. I got high ground now as well. I don't really know what their defense is, to be honest. If they've been dice especially, is that because they are experimenting or because of other reasons? But Magma is absolutely handing it to them. Yeah. They're going on to the techies. They'll get the kill on the Jinkyu. They'll look over at the tier three mid. Uh, this is. I just want to emphasize, Peacock. No new items, no new heroes. This is the best Magma has to offer. That is looking very true. They're going to go over to Faith Beyond, who's been caught out in the back. I'm going to say with Curse Crown, he's going to try and throw a Ghost Ship as well as an X. But there's the Snowball once again. The Ghost Ship's not going to do anything. The Snowball will pull them into the creep, says the mines explode, but don't do much. Finally, nothing to say gets the kill to Kaz. They're starting to mount a little bit of a defense. They go after the Medusa. The charge hits on a Mercy, but the Blink Code from Dust. They'll look to get this kill out on a feet beyond. Eventually, though, they're right on top of this techie who's trying to get the blast off out and does. They got the silence out of the Queen of Pain, but now the follow-up damage just doesn't look like it's going to be there. Snowball in. The kill is there for the Medusa. Finally, Mercy ends up dead. They've got the BKB being popped back up in the say is Ooh, the damage out from Ame to get the kill on the TZY, but just coming in. They've got the silence out on the Ame. They will chase him down, and the Stone Goose is there. There's nothing Ame can do except for die. Rules to avoid the X again. They've done a good job of making sure that well, the effectiveness of Kunkka just isn't there. And they'll call GG. Magma will take this series 2-0 over LGD. And the games are close. They're no, super not at all. Excited. Big stomps. I'm happy to see Magma perform as well. I'm a little bit uh, intrigued by the fact that LGD looks so lost. Because in all honesty, the patch didn't change a whole lot. Like how the yeah. how the game is being played, you know, the, the play styles are still the same.